questions and so forth. But let's talk a little about supplement while we're on the topic. Let me ask you guys a question. And this we're going to deal with on the nutrition, you know. Let me ask you guys a question. What are most supplements made from? Most. Shellfish products. Do you know that most shellfish products are the most nutritious items on the face of the earth? You got to be careful too. And plus the instructions that God give for taking supplements. Did you guys know that? He says simple combinations. If you use too many combinations in putting a supplement together, he considered that toxic. Oh, saints, we're going to take you to the writings. We're going to take you to the writings. That's what we're going to be covering. When we go to prof prophetic guidance, you're going to understand that when it comes to nutrition, you got to eat like colors. You got to eat like colors. What do I mean by eating like colors? You know, like simple combinations, like red and blue. Don't do red, blue, yellow, green, orange, pink. When you do that, it causes war in the stomach. Simpler the combinations, the body's better to, to assimilate that food, break it down and so forth, and utilize it. You do war, it happens exactly what happens when you mix all these colors together, it turns brown for men. Vices, secret vices that um, holds God's children. Um, secret vice like pornography. We found that pornography is something that is captivating God's leadership. Our preachers, our members, our leaders, all of us are be and our women are being captivated. As a matter of fact, do you know what a research, recent research that I got? You know, women are into pornography more than men. They found that women are into pornography more than men. And you know, it makes sense. You know, they're actually more women on the face of the earth than men. So they aren't probably enough men to go around. So as a result, for the ones who may not be able to have access, they found ways to please themselves. Or they fantasize because of the novels, many of the novels that are being read. Am I making sense, these saints? So one of the things that we need to do is understand the implication of self-abuse. As a matter of fact, there's a book called Testimonies on Sexual Behavior, Adultery, and Divorce. And this book is deep. Let me share with you just a little part on, on this book. The other day, I was in this one state. And I did a lecture. I did a lecture just like this, you know? But this one was in a home. No, no, no. This one I originally started out in a church. And then a gentleman came up to me. And he showed me these big bumps all over his bodies. And he says, Brother Luke, you know what these are? I don't. I said, what are they? He said, you know. I'm like, I know. I said, can you explain, sir, if you don't mind, you know? He says, you spoke about them the other day. I said, I did? He says, when you talked about the self-abuse, I said, you got to be kidding me. It was the first time I had ever seen the manifestation. I spoke about it in theory, having faith that the writings was correct, and I saw the manifestation before my eyes. In the book, Sexual Behavior, Adultery, and Divorce, let me set the scene up for you. Do you know, I'll set the scene up on a couple of things, and then I'll break it down. Do you know, for every drop of semen, it has the daily intake of zinc that is absorbed in the intestines on a daily basis? How many guys need that? Raise your hand. Okay, good. Next thing. Do you know that after the loss of zinc, it takes 72 hours to replenish that zinc that is lost? 72 hours. How many days is that? Th three days. Huh, let me add something else. Do you know that zinc is the most abundant trace element found in the eye? If you knew that, raise your hand. The most, uh, oh, I'm coming, I'm coming, Sister Evans. Oh, mercy. Do you know that zinc is the most abundant trace element found where? In the eye. Several years ago, there was a report that 42 men taking Viagra went blind. And people were confused. They did not know how can Viagra cause blindness. But I knew because I'd already read the writings. 
because with the excessive loss of zinc and it's the most abundant trace element found in the eye zinc deficiency causes macular degeneration of the retina and saints i have the research right here in my encyclopedia right here oh saints if you don't have these books you better stop at the table today saints right here so you gotta have the books am i making sense this says and then listen to what it says here zinc is the most abundant trace element found in the eye and you know what people tend to do oh i'll just do that and i'll just go and take a zinc supplement oh but guess what you can't do that if you take too large of a zinc supplement you weaken the immune system oh yes saints do this I'm going to pause right here. And when we come back the next time, I'm going to finish this area. Because this is deep. This is deep. We're going to talk about women. I'm going to finish up with the lumps around the gentleman, the lumps that are on his hand, and how we were able to do that. Are we making sense here, saints? Let me ask you, is the information making sense? You got to get the book, Testimonies on Sexual Behavior, Adultery, and Divorce. And saints, listen to this. We teach from three perspectives. We use the Bible, inspiration, and good science. You'll read it in inspiration and the Bible first, and then later on, you'll come back and see the physical scientific evidence to validate that which you have read. Um, testimonies on sexual behavior adultery and divorce it's under the section on masturbation and then you go in the back at the appendix and then you see all the research information and you can get that at abc at a conference office i'm making sense dear saints let's go ahead and take a few minutes break and elder parks will be up amen mm -hmm.